how vaccines power up the fight versus the virus, even if you're fit and healthy. Imagine you're playing a game and you get a cheat code that lets you practice fighting the boss without taking any damage. Your immune system gets to try out different strategies until you figure out the right moves to defeat it. Knock off helmet, attack knees. Jump on back, attack the claws. Attack the claws, jump on the tail, knock off helmet, jump on back. Figuring it out can be tiring. That's why sometimes we get side effects. Your immune system gets a workout, but there's no way you can get the virus from the vaccine. Oh, oh, did it. But now, if you do see the real boss in the future, your immune system already knows the correct moves to defeat it. Done this before, take the claws, knock off helmet. Sometimes it might take a couple of turns. Okay, give me one more go. That's why we sometimes still see vaccinated people get the virus. And you might ask, if it's still possible to get the virus even when you're vaccinated, then why bother getting vaccinated? Because the boss is hard. Even the fittest, healthiest people can get really knocked around. But vaccinated people beat it much faster. And one less day with the virus will make all the difference in stopping the spread. The best thing is, this isn't a single player game. The more people are vaccinated, the more we win. When we're vaccinated, we're protecting the people around us too. Our parents, grandparents, communities, everyone. Power up, get vaccinated. Mm-hmm.